all taken from our ordinary lives to a place of romance, adventure, and action. Some of the greatest movies of all times contain elements of nature that make way for an action-packed movie. But then this film contains three different movies with disasters involving nature. Everyone knows the story of the Titanic. The two lovers meet a tragic end as the Titanic collides into an iceberg. To understand what an iceberg is, first we must discuss glaciers. Glaciers occur when snow accumulates faster than it can melt. A massive body of snow packs down and becomes thicker and thicker, heavier and heavier, until it has the weight and the mass of a rock, even though it is still frozen water. Gravity then pulls this massive snow pack down to lower elevations, and as it travels, it shapes and scrapes and fractures and changes the surface of the earth. Iceberg is a piece of glacier broken off. Icebergs pose a great danger to ocean vessels, such as the Titanic. Icebergs vary greatly in size and can measure over 100 meters. Giant bergs measure at over 1,000. The movie Twister is about a group of storm chasers in Oklahoma chasing after the biggest tornado in years. So how exactly are tornadoes formed? Tornadoes are generally formed in a thunderstorm. Thunder showers this violent require a complex mix of environmental conditions, but usually include A. Very warm, humid air B. Very cool, dry air to the west and south C. Air to the west trying to replace the warm, moist air D. Upper level, high in the sky Conditions that first hold down warmer air from rising, and then later a complete reverse in conditions that let the warm air rise very fast and very far. And E, an upper level wind stream to move the air away from the rising columns. Sounds complicated. When an asteroid the size of Texas is headed for Earth, the world's best deep core drilling team is sent to nuke the rock from the inside. This is the storyline of Armageddon. So what exactly is an asteroid? Asteroids form from small pieces of rock, dust, metal, just like the rest of the solar system. Small particles run into each other, and if they don't hit too hard, they'll stay together because their gravity pulls them together. The reason why the asteroids didn't, didn't continue to grow into a planet like all the rest of the planets is that they are too close to Jupiter. Jupiter's gravity stirs them up and makes them go so fast that when they run into each other, they usually bounce off or break apart instead of sticking together. The brightest asteroid is Corvesta, and it is the second most massive object in the asteroid belt, with a mean diameter of about 530 kilometers, and an estimated mass of 9% of the mass of the entire asteroid belt. It was discovered by German astronomer Henrik Wilhelm Olbers on March 29, 1807, 
and named after the Roman virgin goddess of home and hearth, Vesta.